Hello friends, welcome on Nestle Mango channel. Guys, I'm Ram Kesting and in today's video, we are going to talk about a very important method that is the application pause and application focus method. Guys, these methods are predefined method in Unity and play a very important role when you minimize your application in Android phone or in your iOS phone or in your window uh, games. So in today's video, we are going to learn about how we can use the on application pause method and on application focus method and i will share more information when you will work on the application or pc so it will play a very important role so let's start the tutorial video if you are new on the channel make sure you have subscribed the channel if you want to ask something so you can drop the question below in the comment box so let's start the today video hey guys so right now we are in visual studio and guys here is our unity so as I have taken one script and uh, let me first tell you the two methods first one is on there are three met methods that are very popular first one on application focus on application pause and on application quit so in today's video we are going to talk about, talk about on application focus and pause and you know about the on application kit in the mobile phone we want to quit the game so you can call this method but today video we are going to talk about on application focus and second one is on application pause so guys what is the meaning of the on application focus guys on application focus this is the value focus focus means it return the this is the focus so first first let's learn about what is the use of this focus focus means if you are on focus means if you are on the focus so it will return true and if you are not on the focus so it will get return false so if you want to work on anything like it is on the focus it is on the not focus what the meaning of the focus this is my unity game let's run it So guys, we are running the game and we are clicking the button but we are running the game and we are on the just on this screen. So this is the focus. But if we are clicking here or we are clicking on the console, so we are not on the focus. So what it will return? It will return false. Or suppose we got the minimize, so we are not the we are not in the focus. So what it means that we are not in the focus, so it will return false. So hope you understand not even you can just go in the background so it means we are not in the focus and again we are coming on the game and right now we are on the focus it will return true so this is the this is the uh, use of focus that we can point out we are in the focus or not and it will work in your PC games PC games only okay I'm, I'm not going to tell you what is the uh, series in which series they will be called but you know very well first a web will call enable then start then this method we will call and let's come to the on application pause method guys both methods are very important role but on application play a very important role in mobile phones when suppose we minimize the application you know how we can minimize our application so what happened at that time that this is the pause boolean variable and when and guys it doesn't mean that if you are in the minimize mode then it will be run no it will run when your game will be run but 
if you are in minimize mode minimize so what it will return it will return true and if you are not minimize so it will return false but it doesn't mean that if you are not in the minimize mode so it will run always no it will it will run first time and then after when you go go in the minimize so it will run or when you come back from the minimize then it will be bug so guys it is for the suppose you want to work something in background like when you are in the background or when your application is paused means you are in the background so first thing we are talking about android so you have to learn this thing because when you try to work in application in background so it play a very important role and mostly in all games you have to do this because uh, sometimes our game in minimize and our client want to respond to our application in the minimize mode so suppose if you are in the android mode so in android mode you you don't have any way to do this you just have only on application pause method so if you want to uh, work anything like if when it goes on minimize so if you want to uh, print something if you want to task anything so you can do here okay yani ki when it will be true so it will perform this task so in the background or in the pause if you want to work something so on application pause will help you okay and suppose you are in the pc so if you want to uh, if you want to perform any task when you are not in the focus not i'm talking about focus not about the background not in focus you have to uh, listen me very carefully if you are not getting my point so you can just watch this video again and again so you have to learn basic thing is that we are talking about here focus here we are talking about background on application pause both are the different things don't take that both are the same thing okay this is all about the background and this is all about the focus your cursor focus okay right like you are filling the any form and the, in the box you have to just click for the focus so right now your focus is here okay so if you are not in the focus and if you want to work something so you can just right here your task not in focus agar focus mein if you are not in the focus it will return false okay so this is not about the background but it will work in the pc and let's know about right now we are going to learn about the pc background this is the key thing suppose you want to perform the task like in the android i have told you the on application pause will work but in the pc on application pause doesn't work so what you will do when you want to perform the uh, if you want to run your application in the background when user is not on your game he, he have just minimize your game like this and if you want to uh, run your application your game on the pc properly so for this you can do the two things first thing on a wake method you can use the code application run in background
where you can do this Okay, you can do this in awake or start method application run in background. So it will run your application in the background. And if you are requesting any data in the background, so it will request. If you are getting any response, it will get the response. So you don't have to worry about anything. Or suppose you don't want to do it. So what you have to do again? This is the second way. It was my first. And right now I'm going to tell you second way second thing is that if you want to do the same thing and if you don't want to write any cost any code so just you have to go So if you don't you don't want to write any uh, any line of the code so what you have to do is that go on the build setting and make sure it is on the PC Mac Linux in standalone then you have to go on the player setting and here you will get run in background so you have to just check mark it run in background and when it will run in the background on your PC game so your all the events or your games will work properly and you don't have to worry about anything and when you run in background so if you are converting your game in Android it is very important thing listen very carefully when we are converting our game in Android and iOS so on the editor this is the editor on the editor it will work in Android too but when you work on the Android phone it will not work so when you are converting on the Android so make sure you have off the this uh, running background okay because if you will not stop it so it will work same in Android and you will, you will not able to point out how your own application pause is working so when you stop it so you can work with the android and with the method on application pause so guys i have told you a very important meet you video today and hope you learned something hope you enjoy the video and guys uh, if you are not able to point out anything i think you are able to point out the on application focus and on application pause and don't take both as the same both are the different so listen very carefully if you are not able to point out so watch video again very carefully i have told everything in this video about the on application pause on application focus and i want to tell you one more important thing that sometimes you have to know about the when your application is pause method and if you want to perform a particular work just you want to detect that your application was in uh, background or not your application was paused or not so for this you can take another boolean value here like boolean minimize and here you can put the false and here minimize here you can put true because you can't use the pause method in whole class so what you can do is that you can get the uh, you can you can know that your application was in minimize mode and on the basis of min you can work uh, you can perform any task so we hope you got my point and so guys hope you are able to uh, point out what is the application focus method what is the on application pause method and what is the role of when you change the player uh, run in background from the player setting so if you enjoy the video so hope make sure you have subscribe the channel and if you want to ask something you can drop your question below in the comment box so thank you so much for watching have a good day keep learning keep growing